Kalera and studying in Podda International School in class 8th. Today we are going to see the question and answers of English poem. The name of the poem is The Man He Killed written by Thomas Hardy. But before watching this video in detail, don't forget to subscribe my channel. So let's start. Word Galaxy Word and its meaning Word Staring Meaning looking with great concentration. Word in meaning a small hotel. Curious eager to know something. Trap a shame of tricking or catching someone. Range arrange in a row in a specified manner. Half a crown a coin formerly used in Great Britain. Infantry an army unit consisting of soldiers who fight on foot. Nipakin a liquid container or vessel with a capacity of half pint or less. Quaint, strange. Let us see the questions and answers. Question 1. Why does the speaker enlist in the army? The answer is the speaker enlists in the army because he was unemployed. Question 2. He thought he had list. Perhaps offhand like just as I was out of work had sold his traps. No other reason why. What is this saying? The answer is by saying the above lines, the only reason he enlisted was because he didn't have any job. And he is assuming that the other man he killed enlisted in the same reason. Question 3. That's clear enough. Although, what is the speaker trying to say? The answer is, by saying the above lines, the excuse that the other army man was his enemy is not good enough excuse. Question 4. Because he was my foe. What is the speaker trying to say? The answer is, he is trying to come up with good excuses on why he killed the other man. Question 5. What is the poem trying to say? The answer is, the soldiers are similar, both enlisted in war. They may have been friends if they have met at bar other than on the battlefield. But they met on the battlefield. Therefore, they had to shoot each other. Question 6. Why does the poet call war quaint and curious? The answer is, the poet calls war quaint and curious because it changes you as a person. The same fellow whom you should have otherwise befriended and offered a drink becomes your enemy on the battlefield. Like the speakers, in the poem, many people cannot think of a valid reason that why they may injure or kill each other and destroy property in a normal situation. Question 7. Explain these lines. He though he list perhaps offhand like just I was out of work. The answer is the poet says that he had enrolled himself in the army just like that without too much thinking. Similarly, he feels the other man could have joined the enemy army maybe because he was out of work or just like that or being in a real need of money. Killing, injuring, fighting must not have been in the minds of both these people. Question 8. Read the lines given below and answer the following question that follows. Had he and I but met by some old ancient inn, we should have sat us down to wet, write many a nipakin. Question A. Who are the people being referred in the above stanza? The answer is the two people being referred to in the above stanza are the soldiers who are narrating an incident and the enemy soldier whom he had killed during the war. Question B. Where does I imagine that they could have been? The answer is the soldier I who is narrating an incident imagines that they could have met at some old ancient inn. Question C. What will they have done? The answer is they will have sat down together and wet many a nipakin or we can say had some drinks together. 
Question D. Which of the words in the above verse suggests that the two will have spent a lot of time together? The answer is the words many a nipakin suggest that the two will have spent a lot of time together. Question 9. Why did the speaker have to kill the other soldier? The answer is the speaker had to kill the other soldier as he was fighting a battle and the other soldier was the enemy. They had faced each other on the battlefield and were firing at each other. Question 10. What would the speaker have done if he had met the other man in any place other than that a battlefield? The answer is, in the poem, the speaker says that he would have greeted the other soldiers, socialized with him and even offered him some money or other help. If he had met the other soldier in any other place rather than a battlefield. Okay friends, I hope you like this video. If you like this video, then hit the like button, share with your friends and if you have any suggestions for me, please write in the comment box. Bye, have a good day. Thanks for watching my video.